All right, man. What's up, YouTube? So we sitting here in on Twitch. Alpha Liking TV is a Twitch. All put together, no spaces. You see, I got a chat here with me, and we started a conversation that can Boruto Sakura defeat Pain from Naruto at her current state? Of course, I said no, but we had a lot of yeses and stuff. Then somebody came to give us a video stating how Sakura is the strongest. Hold on, hold on, y'all. Gotta apply my lip gloss. I mean, damn, what the fuck? I mean, my car match. Uh, the video is titled. Let me even pull it up. <laughs> I can't even talk about it. <laughs> the video is titled "Why Sakura is One of the Most Powerful Ninja in Naruto Shippuden and Boruto." So apparently, this is the thumbnail right here, and this is says, <laughs> "I can't even take this serious." Why Sakura is one of the most powerful ninja in Naruto Shippuden and Boruto six path level. If this ain't comedy, I don't know what it is. Most of y'all know me. You know what I'm saying? I'm an avid hater of Sakura. I don't like her. She's a waste of a character. She's not one of the strongest characters in my book. She's she's just trash. Most people have called her a trash can. And we gonna still call it. Why is the six path in here? Why is six path level in the title, bro? Why? So we gonna react to this. Whatever this person, what's this person? King Bullet. Shouts out to you, man, for making this little video. This is crazy. Uh, 19 minutes. Oh hell no. I will refuse to watch 19 minutes of this. <laughs> I will not. I'm going to watch a couple minutes of this. So let's just go ahead and get into this shit. Hey guys. It's your boy King Bullet, back with another video. Today's video is about Sakura. Now, I've had a lot of time to think. I made a video where I stated Saitama gets clapped by Sakura. And I know that upset a lot of people and a lot Why should I continue this video? Why should I continue this video, bro? Like, let's let's be real. Why should why should we finish this video, bro? Why should we finish? People just be making videos and put on, put on YouTube, bro. He literally just said that he made a video saying Saitama is getting clapped by Sakura. This guy has like probably like seven Sakura pillows. He probably got a pair of Sakura's underwear under his bed. He probably watched all the episodes only with Sakura in it. He probably don't watch the Sakura versus um, Sasori fight like 700 times. Bro, I don't even know if I want to continue, bro. I'm, I promise you I'm not getting through this whole video. This man is tripping 12 seconds in. I ain't never seen nobody trip this fast. What is wrong with this guy? What is wrong with this guy? Let's just see what else he got to say. Let's hear him out. Etc. And a lot of people had to explain to me Sakura's power scaling. So after looking at it properly, this is the honest truth. Sakura is still a god tier in Shippuden. I don't give a fuck what they say. <laughs> this is all my interpretation. So if you're getting angry over somebody's interpretation, then that's a little bit sad. Especially if it's a justified one. Like you need actual reasoning to say it doesn't work. So I want you guys to watch this video properly. And now this is very important. I don't want you going to the comment section. He's still soccer people. Y'all so delusional. Did he just get? He just got mad aggressive, right? He says soccer's got here. I don't care what y'all say. What is this, bro? This can't be real. Hold on, let me see the like to dislike ratio. <laughs> Nobody just. I will. Minute update. Does it show one now? What is this? My dislike is not affected, bro. What's hey going guys, on? I dislike this, bro. What's going on? Is he hiding the dislikes, fam? They wildin', fam. Boy King Bullet, back with another video. Today's video is about Sakura. Sakura is power scaling. So after looking at it properly, this is the honest truth. Sakura is still a god tier in Shippuden. I don't give a fuck what they say. In all seriousness, this is all my interpretation. So if you're getting angry over somebody's interpretation, then that's a little bit sad. Especially you're the only one angry. angry. We're not angry. Reasoning to say it doesn't work. Now I want you guys to watch this video properly. And now this is very important. I don't want you going to the comment section. If you actually disagree with me, I want you actually to join my Discord and debate me. 
you no, are no, being, it's no point. Yourselves, you'll at least watch this video, even if you disagree with it, right? And no, I'm not. Minded, just to see the arguments, right? And then if you have a problem, then you can let me know about it in my Discord. That's no. perfectly fine. No, thank you. No, thank you. I'm not going there. Nice intro. Very nice intro. It's pretty cool. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to address is I'm not a Sakura fanboy or anything. I don't even like Sakura as a character. I think she's, if I'm being completely honest, I don't think she's that good of a character. I don't think she's trash. But I don't think she's really good either. No offense. But when it comes to power scaling, right? The power scaling I'm going to provide is actually really consistent. It's insane <laughs> how consistent she is. Also, another thing. All the feats and scaling I'm going to be using for Sakura is concrete. Okay. None of them are off guard. None of them are gag moments. <laughs> okay. Pure scaling. In this video, I'll be mainly focusing on full power Sakura or Sakura right at the end of Shippuden. But I will briefly be going over her prior versions. So part one Sakura, she's not really that strong. I think there's that one statement saying that like Naruto is the weakest link of Team 7 right before the tuning exams. And um, this is directly to do with strength. So I'd assume that Sakura is beyond base Naruto at this point. And base Naruto can run at like Mark 5. I remember this isn't some amped base Naruto. He can't make a thousand clones. It's pretty much his casual stats. She fights, you know, like, um, who knows Eno scaling? <laughs> no offense. Fuck? Like, However, what? the most important thing in part one is it's actually established she has outstanding chakra control and memory and that she's a hidden talent. Now, this is going to be really important later on, as you'll find out. Apparently, she was like a genjutsu expert in part one or something, so that's weird. You never really see that come up again, other than the fact that she can break genjutsu. She also has like an inner personality that can actually resist mind hacks and stuff. I suppose that's a cool resistance. Oh yeah, and when it comes to knowledge, she's one of the smartest characters in the verse. She's like one of the only people who doesn't even need to cheat in the tuning exams. Anyways, moving on to Shippuden. I have a bell test with Kakashi, and Kakashi and Naruto are both surprised with like how strong Sakura actually is now. And it seemed kind of threatened, so she could be near base Kakashi's level maybe. And apparently Kakashi's wondering if like she's a better ninja than Tsunade herself. But I'm not gonna assume that, there's better scaling anyways. So we know she goes on to fight Sasori. Did he, did he just say base Kakashi, bro? Did he just say that? Or am I tripping? Am I tripping? Did he just say base Kakashi level? Did he say that? Capable of actually harming Hiroko, his favorite puppet, and him himself. Now, I do actually think Sasori was suppressed against Chiyo and Sakura. And the reason I say this is because, like, there was a lot of trauma for him, right? There was emotional trauma. And he kind of looked down upon Sakura even at the beginning. He was calling a girl. He didn't really take her seriously. And uh, we know Sasori actually had really good scaling, right? Okay, now moving on to the Warrock. How strong is Sakura? That's probably what you've all been, like, waiting for, I suppose. Well, we do know her in her base, according to Hashirama, is potentially stronger than 100 healings Sonade. Which is pretty insane, because she's in base and Sonata is not. Also, the same base Sakura is actually stayed equal to KCM Naruto and EMS Sasuke. And they're fighting Vajubi. The same Jubi that's Chakra is actually comparable to a small planet. Now, the Dabuk actually also backs this up right several times, saying that she's actually equal to KCM Naruto and EMS Sasuke. And if you actually look at a direct picture, it's her in her base, so I don't want any, like, arguments. She can also summon... He literally just said, look at her standing there. She's in her base form. What else is she going to turn into? Besides that freaking stupid diamond on her freaking head. What other form is she going to turn into? Katsuyu. Now, Katsuyu is able to heal people. She can actually turn into lots of different slugs and heal people. She should be relative to other other summonings Naruto and Sasuke summon. We can actually avoid attacks from KCM Naruto and EMS Sasuke. And now this is where people actually cap her. I don't know why, but like, she can't get any stronger than this for some reason. Even though it's actually directly stated that she has one of the highest potentials in the verse. And it was kind of established in part one. It's like people think she can't actually get stronger. They forgot she actually has another four. Dude, 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 dude. What's his dude's name? What's his dude's name? King Bullet, you're literally reading a page from Naruto. I'm pretty sure the author thought that she was going to be cold and she turned out ass. This is so long ago. This don't got nothing to do with what she's doing right now. You need to stay off the drugs. 
Big facts. On top of this, right? They forgot she had 100 healings. They literally forgot that every fight, you actually get stronger. It stayed by B, right? Every fight you participate in, you actually get stronger. You weren't talking about Sasuke. Okay, so now Naruto and Sasuke get six buffs amps. That's insane. They fight Madra, and they're all getting bodied. Now, there's an actual statement, right? In the last, so the last that book, that Sakura was actually equal to Naruto and Sasuke in his situation versus Madra. Now, I'm not saying Sakura can actually take Madra. She obviously gets bodied. Yeah, that was a uh, pretty uh, it's pretty cool video, man. Y'all want to check the video out? Go check it out. I low key almost reported the dude video, bro. Like, it's got to be some form of copyright infringement. I don't know what's wrong with this, but yeah, go support his channel. This was a pretty cool video. Uh, I lasted, I don't know what, fourteen minutes. I tried. Soccer still sucks. See y'all next time. Oh, she said.